President Tinubu has done it again. Organized labor comprising the NLC and the TUC has confirmed accepting the 70,000 Naira minimum wage President Bola Tinubu approved for Nigeria workers. <laughs> what a news of the day. Mohamed Idris, Minister of Information, had told State House correspondent that the President announced the offer at a meeting with the Labour leaders at the Presidential Villa in Abuja today. Briefing reporters after the meeting, Comrade Joe Ajairo, President of NLC, said the unions had accepted the offer. The committee, which comprised state and federal governments and the organized private sector, had proposed 62,000 Naira, while Labour insisted on 250,000 Naira as the new minimum wage for workers, who currently earn 30,000 Naira as minimum wage. Labour had said that the 30,000 Naira was unsustainable for any worker going by the economic vagaries of inflation and high cost of living, which followed the removal of petrol subsidy by the president. Last Thursday, the president met with labor leaders and called for realistic expectations as regards minimum wage. He said, you have to cut your coat according to the available material before we can finalize the minimum wage process, we have to look at the structure, Tinubu has said. Flanked by Comrade Festus Usifo, President of the Trade Union Congress, and other representatives of Nigerian workers who attended the meeting, Ajaro said the unions agreed to the offer because of other incentives attached. He said, we were, we were here last week and we are here now. What they have announced in terms of the amount of 70,000 Naira happens to be where we are now. But the thing about it is that we will not wait for another five years to come and agree, Ajero said. The agreement between the two sides followed a series of talks between labor leaders and the president in the last few weeks, after months of failed talks between labor organs and the tripartite committee on minimum wage constituted by the president in January. On a part, Onye Jocha said Tinibu had also directed the minister of Finance and Budget, Wale Edu and Atiku Bagudu, respectively, to work out modalities on how to settle the issue with the Senior Staff Association of Nigerian Universities and the Non-Academic Staff Union of Educational and Associate Institution. The community which comprise state and federal government and the organized private sector had proposed 62,000 while labor insisted on 255,000 as the new minimum wage for workers who currently earn 30,000 Naira as minimum wage. Good day all and welcome back to our YouTube channel, Everyday People's Voice. If you are just joining us, we want to say to most especially our new subscriber and our returnee, thank you for being part of our outstanding news outlet that is devoted and committed to breaking the latest news and headlines to you as it comes. Here, yeah, we also bring to you news in politics, news in current affairs, business news, sports news, entertainment news, and so much more around Nigeria 
and the world, including where and when they happen. Because as you all know, our source of information are reliable and accurate. That's why we are the window to the world. I want to thank you all for staying tuned. But before I continue, if this is your first time of coming across our channel, please help us subscribe, like, and share our videos. Because for doing that, you have done a great deal. Because God says, do the right thing. This, I contribute, this minimum wage, we did not approve so. When I sure say, not be problem it will cause because organized labor say that two hundred and fifty thousand naira they want. You they see also, but Tilibu pega for seventy thousand. Meanwhile, government first talk say they go only fee pay. 62,000 and the current minimum wage na 30,000 naira. And no say it's not good though because this is a big punishment for the Nigerian worker. In the sense, so, how you go expect a man where get family, where they pay transport, where they pay house rent, eh? where they pay school fees. What they feed the family, say at the end of the month, you will give them 30,000 naira. Ah, come on. This thing don't, don't to take for government and this matter, eh? It don't to take. They say also, my tongue got say, at last, uh, Tinubu don't swing into action, don't say he go give the 70,000 plus some incentives. I don't say incentives, they join salary at times, you know. So, with that one, made the kickstart out. But Labour said they don't go wait till so they come back to the drawing board, make the call finalize when to they review this issue because inflation now nah, steady, 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 steady. Because if inflation fee hits and you know increase salary, how you want me the common man to survive? My country people, make a stop for here today. Our comment section day open. We could have shook my pool for this matter. I go see you now again for my next video. I beg, make could have stay out of trouble and on a bye bye. Thank you very much.